Welcome back to Mario Madness's Steel Diver for the Nintendo 3DS walkthrough. Last time we started Mission 5 with the manatee, and now we're going to continue Mission 5 with the blue shark. I apologize, I haven't been uploading Steel Diver, but I've been distracted by other things like the Android games that I've been really seeing on Mario Madness, the new Android games, and Kirby's Epic Yarn. But I'm hopefully going to uh, post a few, a couple more uh, 3D uh, Steel Divers still divers today or the next day as of this video being recorded so uh if you're watching this like in a month do not listen to what i'm saying right here so as you can see i've activated the decal of the snail which reduces the damage taken from all sources which which i guess i which i'm guessing we're gonna need because because this we have yeah, okay i'm just gonna spoil it for you wait no we have okay i'm not gonna spoil it for you <laughs> Sorry, I can't talk today, but we have a certain something that's going to need a, need us to reduce damage taken from all sources. So nonetheless, let's get started. If you watch my walkthrough in order, I don't think it's going to be... I'm guessing you're gonna, you'll remember this. It's a fire torpedo right there because it'll destroy that mine. There's another mine right over here. And Okay, destroyed that also. Oh wait, no, no, okay. So you want to, of course, destroy this ship. Okay. So I'm sorry if I'm a little rusty and I don't talk much just because Again, I'm rusty and I'm not quite as good at, as, at Steel Diver nowadays. Okay, please don't hit me. Okay, die. Ugh. Wait, what just hit me? Was it a... I think it was a... I think it was a, a, a mine or something. I don't know. Depth charges. I have no idea what it was, never mind. So again, sorry I'm not really commentating much, just trying to focus on getting the level. There's not much to say, honestly. You know, it's, it's, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to deal with you today. Um, <laughs> there's not much to say, honestly. I've already done this level, and it's not, it, it, I mean, it's not, not something, it's not something that's new. Well, anyways, let's destroy this rock. That will give us a water current. And, uh, woo! So if you need to, recharge your health. And, uh, continue downwards. There will be two subs down here. They are a, they are like the subs that shoot torpedoes out in all directions so you probably most likely want to kill them if you don't feel like killing them be like me I always feel like killing submarines with the manatee but that's only because that that sub can shoot can shoot can uh, shoot torpedoes vertically and the blue shark and all and like the serpent they can't shoot torpedoes vertically so it's hard to destroy ships when you can only angle your sub vertical which I do not like doing. So anyways, we're actually nearing the end of the level. <laughs> and uh, if you need to, just refill your health up here and you will be at the end of the stage. Whee! I, I, can, I am not going to imagine what the chaos is when, when, a, when a sub comes out of the water like that. Don't really know. Oh, it's a boss fight. <laughs> yeah. Welcome to your next boss fight of the game. So the way you fight this guy is that he uh, he opens that door and you can fire in there. Your torpedoes do extra damage if you fire them in there. Now sometimes he fires out a torpedo, a torpedo out there. What's really cool is that even even when he uh. Even when he doesn't, even when the door's not open, you can still damage his body. So, uh, let's 
Let's go back with him. Unfortunately, I'm about to hit the thing. Wait, yeah. Oh no. Jeez, my ship's already down to halfway health. I'm about to get hit again. Oh, maybe not. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna get hit again. Oh, jeez. This is truly terrible. And I might lose. I, I might lose because of this. Oh, cool. He's, his health is, is like really down. Okay, so right now he has a missile launching attack that he's about to do. About to do. Oh, I actually got him. I actually got him before he before he did his missile attack. Basically with the missile attack, he just like he just like um he did he just like shoots missiles at you. So it's it's not that hard to dodge if you just go to the other side. And, uh, unfortunately, I don't have enough time for the post-mission periscope strike, so I'll see you. So I hope you enjoyed this part, and I will see you in the next part where we do the post-mission periscope strike and do mission five with the serpent.